it's Becca and welcome to the Carriage House, a little place to find comfort and cozy inspiration for your hearth and home. I'm in our little farmhouse on this early spring afternoon and just finished taking down our Easter decor and just wanted to fill those empty spaces with some candles, maybe some pretty tea towels, bright greenery, just simple and inexpensive things that I love to have on hand at home and can be used any time of year. So I'm actually making my own candles today. It's so easy to do and it can actually be very therapeutic as long as you don't rush through it. But purchasing candles can become very expensive over time as you know. So not only can it save you money making your own, but it's a wonderful way to connect to the old ways of the past while making your home feel cozy and inviting. So I just melted my wax that's made of soy and going to prepare my mason jars that I love to use as a vessel for candles. So today I'm going to keep it simple though and not going to add any essential oils or anything like that. Just wanting a clean burn for today. But for spring and summer candles you could add lemon essential oils for fall. Maybe add some cinnamon and clove and um, for the winter season orange and pine would be lovely. So now that the candles are cooled, I'm going to add some pretty fabric and twine to them, sort of making them look like those old-fashioned cottage style of uh, jelly jars. And I love to keep light pieces of fabric around like this to decorate our home just during the seasons. I try to buy several bundles each time I visit the fabric store. But again, for autumn time, deep gold tones and browns and oranges would be a lovely color of fabric to choose. For spring and summer, maybe nautical styles or bright and sunny yellow tones would look nice. And finally for winter, maybe a cute gingerbread print of some kind tied with twine and holly.
So now that that little tear tray is decorated, I think I bought that at Hobby Lobby, by the way, a long time ago. Um, but I'm going to use pretty bowls, more tea towels, and greenery to add to all those little places that was once decorated for Easter. But now the seasons have changed, and I always look forward to each and every one of them each year. So thank you so much for stopping by while I decorated my home this afternoon and I hope all is well and hope to see you soon. Bye. Are you done? Yeah.